Good afternoon, on what is a um, mild, uh, bright, but cloudy day. It is Sunday the 2nd of April. I've got a nice hot cup of tea. Um, and a parcel to unbox. So, what is in here? And what I've got it's the complete Uxbridge English Dictionary, um, com comprehensively reviled, um, and um, it's as featured on, I'm sorry, I have the clue. Now, um, so, uh, if you don't know it, I'm sorry, I have the clue, is a long-running Radio 4 series. It's a comedy series. Um, you know, it's a panel game um, at, uh, 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 you know, basically absolutely nothing. Um, to, um, where everything is made up on the spot, uh, hence why I am. Um, I've got that in the background um, because we went to see um, the latest tour um, last weekend. So, the complete Uxbridge dictionary. Uxbridge dictionary. So, uh, do words fail you? Never again. Once you become the proud owner of the complete Uxbridge English dictionary. Every word has meaning, but over the years those meanings change. Dip into those helpfully, helpfully illustrated pages and you'll find many of the words you use every day without ever realising that their up-to-date definition is something entirely different. Words like bunny, rather like a bun. Or cherish, rather like a chair. Cardiology, the study of knitwear. Or buggery, the study of insects. Uh, Venezuela, a gondola with a harpoon. Or Norway, a, 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 a Geordie exclamation of surprise, Ivy, uh, the Roman for four, or Faculty, Cockney for there's no more PG tips. Thanks to the complete Oxford Dictionary, you can now use familiar everyday words in total confidence, fully appraised uh, of, of their latest meanings. Happy wording. So, um, yeah, anyway. Um, for many years, the Uxbridge English Dictionary of New Meanings has been a regular feature of the popular four Radio, four, Radio 4 comedy panel show, I'm sorry I haven't a clue, over four decades, now actually five, um, the, 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 the nation's leading punsters, and as you heard with the uh, early entries on, 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 on the blurb, there's a lot of punning, um, which, is why I'm, which is why I'm actually re really fond of it. Um, have built up a collection of common words and, and what they might or ought to mean. This dictionary now gives you the opportunity to browse through the very finest examples of comedic uh, lexicography constant, currently available. Um, at, um, so, let's just... Um, I'm going to show you absolutely my... I don't know where it's in here. Um, I'm just going to find it. At, uh, here we are. Um, where are we? Um, so I've actually changed it because, um, um, so one of my favourites is stockade. Now the, here, the, 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 their definition, let me just show you there, is um, a charity for OXO addicts. Now OXO, of course, in, if you don't know, in the UK, is it basically is is like a, um, a, a, a cube which you basically. Add, add water to to make gravy. So yes, a charity for Oxford addicts. But my actual favourite version of this, which was in the um, previous version, so this has been updated, is um, a, a a meaty fizzy drink, stockade. Um, at, uh, so yeah, and I mean you know the thing is I could actually go through this just reeling off word after word. Um, at, uh, so you know you've got a list of contributors there. Too too long to read out. Um, at, uh, and the primary authors of the book, you know, long-running members of the, um, I'm sorry I haven't a clue team. Sadly, not all of them are with us um, anymore. At, uh, and then um, we have um, we have an introductory, which is as silly um, as the rest of the book. Um, and honestly, uh, this book almost is just funny. It's it's. Um, um, you know, A4, a road made of paper. Um, it's constantly, you know, abattoir, three in a bed, three in a bed in a monastery, or just flipping through. Um, intermittent, where I go camping, 
Um, at, uh, at so many, um, you know, investment, thermal underwear for bankers, um, <coughs> iPod, optical aid using peas, um, at uh, ski lift, the elation you feel after eating a yogurt, which is a joke that doesn't really work unless you know that, 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 that um, you know, decades ago you could buy a brand of, of yogurt called ski um, at, uh, um, you know um, snappy what a baby crocodile wears um, at, uh, um, you know slippery a bit like a sliver as I say I could keep going on and on this is just a book that's really funny just to dip into um, and it's I'm gonna say it is funny it if you get a chance to listen to the radio show yourself, that's actually worth it. You can find clips of it on YouTube. Um, just look up, I'm sorry I haven't a clue, or Uxbridge English Dictionary, and you'll get the delivery, uh, which they can do far better than I can. So, yeah, that's the complete Uxbridge English Dictionary. Um, meanings of words you never knew. Anyway, thanks for watching another unboxing in the nook. If you've enjoyed this, then please do click on the like button down below. And of course, if you've got any comments or feedback, I do appreciate you taking the time to post those. And lastly, if you want to be alerted to get more unboxings in the Nook, where you'll see me out here uh, with a package containing a book or game, which I will unbox and chat about to the best extent of my knowledge for roughly 10 minutes or so, all of course accompanied by a nice hot cup of tea, then please do click on the subscribe button down below. Thanks again for watching. Be back again soon with another one. Bye for now.